everyone. I'm Donna Bush with your CIG TV News update. Immigration officials have sent back 32 Cuban migrants over the past two weeks. On Tuesday this week, officials escorted a group of 23 migrants back to Cuba that had arrived in the Cayman Islands in early March. A group of nine migrants that landed a few days after returned home to Cuba on April the 9th. Now, 30 migrants remain at the Immigration Detention Center where, where they await the outcome of their processing by Immigration Department officials. Premier the Honorable Alda McLaughlin recently met with Dr. Bhuti Kal, the uh, Deputy Regional Representative, United Nations High Commissioner for Refu Refugees. The courtesy call by Dr. Kal uh, took place in the Premier's office. Dr. Kal is seen as a resource person based in Washington, D.C. for the U.N. Early Warning and Preventative Measures Capacity Building Course that's run by the United Nations System Staff College. He has trained UN government and NGO officials in several countries, including Senegal, uh, Papua New Guinea, Cameroon, and South Africa. Well, recently, the first ever Cayman Airways Invitational Youth Cup was announced. Five regional and international club teams will begin competition on May 6th in the under-14 boys level. Attracting high-level competition to Cayman is a pillar of the Football Association's plan to build our next generation of national players, said CONCACAF and Cayman Islands Football Association President Jeffrey Webb. The tournament has been made possible by Academy Sports Club, a regular competitor at overseas tournaments who initiated the contacts with the regional and international clubs and has worked with the West Bay Sports Foundation to produce, this, to produce this tournament. Now teams from England, the United States, Honduras, Jamaica, and Trinidad and Tobago will travel to Grand Cayman for the five-day tournament. The Cayman Islands under-14 under national squad is also a major part of the competition. Now local football officials are encouraging everyone to come out to support the Cayman under-14 team during the five days of the uh, tournament. Again, the Cayman Islands Cayman Airways Invitational Youth Cup is an international under-14 tournament with the aim of bringing teams from around the world to, to Cayman Islands annually for the event. If you'd like to sponsor this event, you can call them at 927-7011. That's 927-7011. For more details, you can go online to the Cayman Islands Government Facebook page. All right, everyone, don't forget uh, Radio Cayman's Talk Today show. That's weekdays from 1215 with host Sterling Duane Ebanks. And remember, you can watch the CIG TV News Update rebroadcast throughout the night and tomorrow, or you can go to our Facebook and YouTube pages. All right, that ends today's CIG TV News Update. I'm Donna Bush, as always, wishing you a good night and inviting you to join us again right here on Thursday. <laughs>